Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to set up a uh, dashboard on uh, your mobile phone or on your laptop. Okay, so what we have to do now is uh, go to this site. I'm going to include it in the video description. Then you can go to download zip. But first I'm going to show you what we can find on this page. Okay, let's download the zip file. It starts automatically. Uh, when the zip uh, file is downloaded, we're going to open the map where it's downloaded. Now we are going to yeah, copy it. And now we can put it on our desktop. So now that we did this, now we can extract it. I'm going to use uh, 7-zip. I'm going to extract it. So now we have this map. I'm going to double click it, and as you can see, we got a uh, few things. Now this map, you can open it, and there is the map for Android. You have to put this on your cell phone and install it on your cell phone. So you can use it to see the dashboard. But first we got to uh, do the server map. And we have this one. We're going to make a shortcut to our desktop. And now we can close this map and double click the shortcut. It's going to ask you to for a setup. This uh, program does it for, uh, does add these things for you at your firewall and installs the plugin. Now just click install. It doesn't take long as you can see. Now press OK. And now we have the server. Uh, OK. So this is going to be different. This is my IP in my uh, network uh, environment. And this you have to give in on your laptop. I will show you shortly. And this is the URL that your app is using for the dashboard on your mobile phone. So now it's time to start the game. So before we can do this, I'm going to show you my laptop. And on the laptop, you go to your internet browser doesn't matter which one I'm using Chrome the link that uh, you find in your server window now I give it in so I'm just going to press enter and you can see it now as you can see we got uh, a whole lot of dashboards that you can use Hunter per hours uh, miles an hour now you can use all these but actually I know from playing around with it that all these dashboards are lagging for the most used one you got to use without lag you have to choose one of those I'm going to show you in this one and I'm going to show you on my phone at the same time now for your phone it's strongly Strong, strongly recommended to 
set your phone up that when you plug it in that the display doesn't turn off automatically by itself now before we can uh, start we have to go to our to our phone and find the ETS window now click it so now I can take on my phone the kilometer per hour one and it's gonna ask you on which you want to use it I'm going to select Google Chrome on my phone so now as you can see it's loading set your phone on uh, rotate the display And now you can see we have uh, both dashboards on our phone. Oh, come on. Yeah, sometimes it's, uh, it stays there. Okay, let's start our game. I always use a shortcut on my desktop. Yeah. As you can see, I don't use my desktop. And you're going to see the game is starting. We're now in. Into the game, you're going to see it's registered automatically. Let's turn on our truck. You can see everything is registering just like it should. Uh, I'm going to drive a little bit so you can see it works just fine. So thank you for watching and uh, 